we're going for a girl with my sister. We've got the planes out there. Oh, the Starbucks. We both got iced chai lattes and it's bloody freezing. Oh, guys. I'm so excited. I can't wait to film this vlog for you guys and just enjoy the sun. My suitcase, you better come back to me. Send back. It was so hard to get that 22.6. Which one's that one? I don't like that, it's like fresh, like, orally. Mmm. That's good for like every day, I think. Yeah. Oh, did you see my nose? Oh, yeah! Oh, no, that's pretty played off. I know. I've tried like six now, none of them look good. No. No. We don't like that. Well, let's just conclude that nothing suits me. <laughs> it's ew, the light's so disgusting. Mm. We didn't I bring our coats. I should have bought a blanket. Getting on the plane. It's freezing. It's cold. Bring me bring me to the sun now. so nice this is a resort or i think is it a resort the hotel we're staying at it looks really nice the pool's really big although in the pictures they were like more square so i'm confused so we're gonna go have lunch our uh, room is not ready yet so we're just gonna have try the lunch at the hotel and see how that is but the flight overall was pretty well like my legs were aching by the end of it but it's so nice my sister's loving it oh my god you can see the mountain oh the mountain yeah that's a nice view i don't know if you guys can see this is what i got guys i've got a bit of um aubergine couscous chicken fish beans and it's pretty good so far. This is our view, literally so clean. So the hotel food. My sister's getting all the time. Speedboats, do you want me to lose a two? The crowd likes the spa bit. I would like to walk around, but it's bloody hot. And I'm in joggers. All right, guys, we're in our room finally. This is our hallway. Aisha, have you seen the bathroom? What the hell? This is huge. There's a bidet. There's a bidet. The shower looks huge. Oh, oh beautiful petal on the top. I don't, know. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, obviously, it's not like perfect, but. I think it looks like, really nice. I'm literally boiling. This is what we've been wearing in this heat. We've got a mirror here so we can see our outfits. You see me through the thing. <laughs> These are where the beds are at, and we've got the TV here, which has M6. If you're French, you know what I'm talking about. But, like, they have French channels. A lot of people speak French in Morocco. And then me and my sister have separate breads. We've got so much space here to put all of our junk. It's going to be super messy in this room, I just know it. But this is a nice spot for me to film my little get ready with me and just do makeup in general. And it's nice, you can see like your whole outfit. We've got a little sofa here. And then we've got a balcony. Guys, and this is our view. 
can see a bit of the sea at the back but this is mostly our view we're just getting ready to go to the pool um I need to put some SPF to be honest because uh, the sun's hitting like majorly and I hope the water will do my skin some good to be honest because I need it. <laughs> Alright guys, it's the next day and it's my sister's birthday! And so, and so, and so all done up um this is like our day look um oh all the sun the sun is shining um we're gonna do we're gonna try and go to the market today and maybe do camel camel riding it just really depends what they have available right now we're gonna go have breakfast and yeah just make the most of the day really this is my sister's outfit our breakfast in the sun i got coffee my sister got orange juice yeah fresh orange juice she's happy this is all she wanted the pancakes the reception area is so nice we're just trying to book the excursion but i think we're going to go by ourselves to the sook i'm going to take a red taxi the guy was saying orange but i see red with my eyes i know when i said orange I was like, i'm not seeing one orange taxi around this we were having a full debate i'm going to show you guys a taxi and you guys are going to tell me in the comments if it's red or orange it's actually orange it's an orange taxi Okay, I give you our brochure, our business card. If no, you no, we're, we're close by so we get Maybe. Here. Okay, Because I have a lot of options. I want to have a. Okay, that's take nice. time to look at it. Guys, I'm really confused because we got the taxi and we said we wanted to go to the market and he stops us halfway for this argan oil shop and just abandoned us. Like, to like we're not taken seriously. Like, he's yeah, gone to watch the game. Okay, he's coming now. I'm so confused. They're all watching the match. Hey, so cute. Hi, boys. We're getting some shawls. I don't know how to say in English, but yeah. Can I see the pattern? Yeah, that one is fine. Thank you. I'm getting that for our mum. Thank you. So this one. No, just How much? One, this and this too. 45. Wow. I want to find a jewelry shop. I think I'm gonna get these earrings. They look super pretty. Trying to like still take in the fact that we're here in a market. Like just me and my sister in Morocco, like it's crazy, it's so beautiful. Um we got two shawls and I got a pair of earrings. But yeah, we're just walking around and enjoying it. We're getting a few souvenirs for the family. Mm. Maybe this one for mommy. I like this one. This one? This one for mommy. Yeah. We got bracelets. Everyone's just busy watching a match. Oh, I really want to get some fruit. Guava? 
Do you have this one? Do you have this one, but this color? Yellow. It's okay. It's okay. This is getting tea. Such a nice experience. We got a few bits to be honest. Lots of souvenirs. Um, I'm really happy with the shawl that we got. How do you say shawl in English? Like a scarf. Yeah, a scarf. Yeah, it's so nice. We got one for my mum. And yeah, I'm just gonna go have lunch now. I'm literally starving. It's so hot, guys. Just got this. Open it. <laughs> We're back home. Oh god, I'm not gonna lie. The market was a little bit stressful, a little bit stressful for me because, like, at one point, this guy like literally just ra like dropped his phone and ran after us and was like, "Hello, hello, hello!" And like, oh, it was just a lot, a lot, guys. But we just got back to the hotel and she folded my pajamas. How sweet! Oh, where did you find the towels? No, I think that's cool. We were cold yesterday, so we were trying to look for these uh, scarves in the hotel shop. And it was like 206 Durham, so it was like roughly 26 pounds for the scarf. And the lady was so nice yesterday, she was like, honestly, like go to the market and get yourself one. And we paid £4.50. So yeah, I'm really happy about the little shop and walk around. We've been walking around for hours. My feet. <laughs> Um, but yeah, like we got the taxi guys again. Taxis are so cheap here. It's crazy. It was like three pounds For like how how long was the journey five minute ride like yeah. you pay minimum six pounds for the uber Anyways The guy in the taxi is just like talking and talking and he just brings us to this random argan oil shop he says he wants to go see the football match in the coffee and just dumps us in this argan oil shop and he didn't, ask him. he didn't even ask he didn't he just left us there and we were in a shop we're like welcomed as if we had an appointment there or something yeah, <laughs> and then we were just like we don't want to buy anything it's not like i'm telling you it's not meant to smell like that yeah and my sister wants argan oil and she was considering to get one there anyways but when she smelled it like it just didn't smell right but yeah he sprayed the argan oil on her and she didn't like the smell i don't mind the smell no it's, it's true that it's not meant to smell of anything yeah it's true if it's really pure like it shouldn't have a scent it, it was quite a lot you know it was like 37 pounds for like a small bottle now we're just walking across the beach i feel like we're gonna be we are gonna be walking for quite a bit and hopefully we can catch some camels on the beach that you can ride on or take pictures with found some restaurants we're just literally walking around to be honest but we might get some ice cream from this Italian restaurant we're walking in the sun and an ice cream sounds pretty good pretty good right now it's just that we haven't found any shops anywhere nearby to look around we can in. Walk up that way, there, back that way. Yeah. Rather than that, that way. And maybe just get a taxi back to the hotel. Guys, <sighs> okay. look at the beach back. Hmm? Oh yeah. Yeah, let's do that in the water. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna walk back in the water. Uh, can we get a pinot? Pinot, yeah. Um, pina colada. <laughs> and um, a tiramisu. Yeah. Pina colada virgin. Yes. Thank you. And it has everything. Oh, we really, really enjoyed. The tiramisu that we got it was so nice and my little espresso I didn't have tea but now we're just walking on the main road I'll show you guys not right works. we're trying to find the shops I think they're at the end of this road how much is this one 
Look, Asda, Asda. Oh, how you know Asda? Yeah, no, Asda <laughs> sounds great, Morrison. From India? Yeah, we're Indian. Sharokana. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> what is your last class for both? 200 each. So yeah, no, no, no. no problem. No problem. Okay, okay. No. like sky. If you're wondering why I have a big ball on my nose piercing, I had to go get it changed because it wasn't healing. I had a lump and since they changed it, it's gone and it's healing. So if you're wondering why I have this, it's only temporarily um, until it heals properly and I can put a proper stud in. It's the sunset Going back home early. Oh, what a stressful morning. Hey guys, as you can tell, I'm back home. This trip was definitely eventful because we were meant to fly back Saturday, but on Friday, morning we were we had a whole day planned and everything to go out and about visit some shops go to a restaurant and like we had a bunch of things planned and we were like in bed facetiming our mom and then all of a sudden i get like a calendar like my outlook calendar notifies me that my flight has changed and literally says that our flight is in three hours it was so funny because my sister didn't want to believe me because i was so calm I just didn't know how to process it because it's like, you know when you're in those nightmares and you're late for flight, it felt like a nightmare. I haven't traveled since 2019 
and I don't have a lot of experience traveling yet so I do get a little bit nervous at times everyone's different but that's just how I feel but we, we just didn't know what to do because we had to be there in two hours because um, the baggage check-in closes a bit earlier we couldn't reach easyjet so we called our brother our brother called easyjet and they were so oblivious like they were so unhelpful we told her our, our flight has changed it says that we need to be there in three hours blah 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 what's the next flight she goes oh there's a flight tomorrow and she mentions our original flight and then she goes oh wait no that's been cancelled and i'm like that's why we're calling you we we ask her when's the next um what's the what's the next earliest flight and she goes there's nothing until like after the 27th and that was like almost three days later and to be honest i didn't want to stay longer and also my sister had work so we were just like you know what we're gonna go get this flight our flight to morocco was super empty like everyone was changing seats we had like this lady had this whole row to herself like it was pretty chill and i think that's why i really enjoyed that flight our flight back was packed there wasn't even a free seat and i feel like they didn't have enough people on our original flight on saturday so they just jam packed everyone into the friday flight so yeah that's basically what kind of happened and we ended up chucking all our stuff in the luggage literally like rushing to the airport to make sure we get this flight it's a beautiful country and i'll definitely go again the views were amazing we did some really nice activities it was so nice to have some sun but i just feel like the flight we the flight issue cut our trip short even though we had a four day plan so got my piercing changed because i really didn't like the ball so this is the one we got it's like the bvla one and in white gold and it has the aquamarine stone it's really nice guys i love it so much it's very dainty to be honest my piercing wasn't healing very well i had an irritation bump it's like those big bulgy red bumps next to your piercing it was so ugly next year hopefully it will be filled with traveling so make sure to subscribe so you can stay tuned and i will have another vlog up for you guys soon so yeah thanks so much for watching give this video a like and subscribe and i will see you in my next video bye